Alright, hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome to Nefarious. It's a, uh, I guess it's kind of a reverse platformer? I don't know how to describe it, but effectively, uh, if it's not immediately obvious, we get to play as the villain, and we're gonna be kidnapping some princesses here. Stop me if you've heard this one before. Bad guy crashes party, kidnaps princess, makes dramatic exit. Plucky handsome hero gives chase. Epic quest ensues. But funny story. Yeah, I'm the bad guy. Aw, oh, come on. They have voice acting for a bit of it. Yeah, I'm the bad guy. The curses of my name will be caked on the walls of those who serve justice. His name's Crow. Gotcha. So there's some amount of voice acting here. Was all that really necessary? Yes! Grab your microphone. If, you, if you're going to be making noises at me, grab your mic. Otherwise... Well, I'm just wondering if the princess is going to be with you the entire time. There are going to be multiple princesses. Yes. Grab your mic. All right, now that I've got my plus one, <laughs> uh, let's get out of it. Let's continue. Okay, beware jumping, not just for heroes. Okay. I can just beat them up. Can I collect these? I Watch can. Watch me join this, and then she doesn't say a word for the rest of this. Uh, She'll have to. No, there, there's totally, there's totally writing. It is going to be a more traditional platformer, I guarantee. Can I double jump? No. So I guess the point is I'm supposed to do that. Oh, the poor cops. They've caught robots. Unfortunately, it's a bit of a traditional platformer once you get past this point. Oh, I can just stand on that guy. Oh, wait, do I get HP back that way? No, I don't. Can I break the these? No. Here's the question. Keyboard and mouse. Okay. Oh, no. Whoa, those are bombs, aren't they? No, it's, it's like a jump pad. Huh. Okay. Music is oddly groovy. It works. There we go. Locked. Feh. Keys are for chumps. A solid punch ought to open this puppy up. Oh, I right click to punch. That's different. Okay, we get cash, I guess. I... I'm really confused here. I was not expecting this to be such a traditional platformer. Uh, sort of? I don't know. I was kind of hoping that it would be a little bit more fast-paced and getting to the whole, like, you are evil doing evil things. Is it... Is it using pounds or something? Uh, it kind of looks like some kind of weird alternative to yeah. pounds. Man, I don't even know what I'm collecting here. We're just collecting stuff. I- it's weird. Oh, it has an eyeball. Oh, and it shoots at me, okay. The animation style is really nice, actually. Can You're I do anything? You're almost out of health. You have one heart left. Oh. Let's see if a crown. Interesting. Standing on it makes it freak out. Yep. Okay, well, there's our health kit we're looking for. Ow. Oh, those health kits are substantial, though. They're- not for slou slouches. Okay, is there anything down there? Probably not. I think they had... Oh. Hey, watch where you're stepping, you oaf! Eesh, my bad. Okay. Uh, what? It just seems so jazzy. It's yeah. Like it's supposed to be the 50s or it something. It is very jazzy. I mean... Maybe 60s. Classy villain. Yeah, I was expecting something a little bit more. Dodo grill, adopt a pod. <laughs> Dodo grill, adopt a pod. Pick up your eight-legged friend today. There we go. <laughs> okay, does those? Okay, it looks like those are just uh, full heel capsules. That's interesting. I, I dig how smooth the animation is. It's actually kind of weird. Well, that's electrified. Yeah. There's got to be. Oh, I know how we get across. We just jump on them. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you can ride these uh, police bots wherever you want. Oh, hey, there's a disc. Like a vinyl? My theme song in vinyl form. This will look good in my jukebox. Uh, only you would have a note progression that spells out bad. B-A-D. Yep. 
It works. I wonder if I can... So that would be like... B-A-D. I was kind of hoping I could... What the? Something just shot through the ground. All right, whatever. Oh, these guys look loyal to you. Boss! We've all... We've held the outer perimeter as you requested. And we set up your death ray just up ahead. Time to start this assault in earnest. <laughs> it's interesting. He so uses... he has robot minions. Yeah, he's got... Well, I mean, they just have... They fists. could just have suits. I have no idea. Whoa. Okay, there we go. This is the MCPD. Put the princess down or we will open fire. Do You do know she's not bulletproof, right? <laughs> wow, so they are going to risk killing her to... Ah, no, 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 no. See, it's bad. that happened to me all throughout my misplaythrough. Yeah. For you, it wasn't a choice. For me, it's just a bit of a surprise. Is there anything else I can do here? No, it doesn't look Wait, like it. Wait, wasn't a choice? Well, the game is just in borderless windowed mode, which comes as a bit of a surprise to me. I mean, part of it is you could technically have enemies spawning off screen. Or yeah. moving off screen. Oh, I see how I'm supposed to do this. Are you going to hit one of those guys into the cannon? Yeah, I, that's what I'm supposed to do, apparently. Ah, crap. And... Uh, recover. Butterfingers. But... Oh, well, I'm not recovering that. Yeah. It costs you pounds. Or whatever the currency is. Yep. But, sadly, I'm not going to be able to recover that at all. Wow, that was a lot faster, all of a sudden. That was a very Sonic boss, actually. Oh, hey, can recover it. Good stuff. Yeah, this feels like a weird fusion between, like, Sonic uh, and Shovel Knight. Sort of. Boss, you're okay, or whatever. Hey, Tyrone, how's the family? Hey, Mrs. May Maple, they're great. Oh, Miss May Maple, they're great, they're something. Knock it off, stop being nice to my minions. Hench Force, have Becky send my care package. It's time to blow stuff up. <laughs> Becky sends a care package? Okay. Oh, I got grenades now. Oh, but I've only got three. Ah, oh, but they do charge up. Okay, that's cool. Oh, hey, who's this? Ah, next? right on time, my old rival, Mac. Mac, my hero. Crow. Me, Apple. Don't you have some heroic banter you'd like to toss my way? Just go get your your giant eyeball laser, whatever it is. Then I can kick your butt and we can get on with this. Okay. I need to talk to May Apple. Oh, I see. I'm supposed to hit that. There we go. I'm glad the r grenades recharge. Okay. Yep, so I have a projectile I can chuck. Handy. Looks like it explodes on contact, too, so I don't have to time it. The Swell Hotel? Eh. Yeah. It works. I guess. Oh, hey, that must be your flying ship. Yeah, that's our, that's our flying ship in the background. it's purple. Why yep. is evil always purple? I don't know. It's my favorite color. Maybe you're evil. Uh, I think I was reading the psychology of it. Oh. Finally, my knight in shining armor! My hero! My love! May Apple, I'm breaking up with you. Uh, what Now? You're doing this right now? Hello, supervillain, right here. We barely see each other anymore. You spend more time with Crow than me. Because he kidnaps me? And now you're defending him. You two are inseparable. Guys... McIntyre Donald Mulder, you get up here and rescue your princess right now! I don't have time for this anymore. I have real crimes to stop. Hey! I'm committing a real crime here! The nerve. I've never been so insulted. I know, right? Well, this is awkward. I had victory music planned and everything for the day I finally defeated Mac. Uh, let's just go. <laughs> yeah, okay. Can I st still play the music? <laughs> sure, whatever. 
Ba -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> I like how he was actually singing his music. Yeah, it works. I, I like the game's style. It's definitely got, uh... <laughs> it's got class. He just gave up! Ugh, I might be a villain, but he's the real jerk here. Becky! Boss, Princess Mayapple? Shall I have meant what? Prepare your suite. Uh, uh, hey, Bex. No, I think I'll go gaze off at the deck wistfully for a while. I have some steam I need to blow off. Very well. I shall have the minions prepare your usual spelt risotto and nice side of soup a pisto. It's as I- it's as though I don't command fear anymore. He just flew away! Uh, boss, I believe you may be able to utilize this as an opportunity. Of course! I know that! I just wanted to win! But not like this. Uh, perhaps you can clue me in on what exactly the plan is? We never seem to keep Mayapple long enough to move on to step two. Kidnapping the princess is a time-honored villain tradition. I've been putting together plans for a royalty-powered death ray, and... Uh, I... This doesn't feel right. Evil scheme Molinologue should be dictated to heroes before I destroy them. I would think, as your major domo, it is prudent to keep me in the loop. Here is all you need to know. I'm a genius, and we need five princesses. Once that is complete, I can rule the world and reshape it as I see fit. Uh, very well. Then we must now travel abroad to the other kingdoms. The Syndicate of Malice will not look favorably if we start kidnapping the designated princesses of other villains. But I am certain I can find a loophole to bypass protocol laws. Next step is Princess Apoidia from the Insectia Sectia Kingdom. Oh, okay. When you're ready to proceed, go up the elevator to the bridge and take the wheel. Now, were you clicking ahead, or no, was it... No, it's automatic. I I don't know if you noticed, but I actually have my hand wow, on the keyboard. Wow, their reading speed was fast. It is very quick. Now, I assume if we're going to Insectia, it's going to be the... Oh, hey. Well, is it going to be the bee queen that we yeah, saw? Yeah, it's the bees next. I have no idea how to... They did not... All right, I guess I have to use a controller for this. All right. <laughs> oh, this is funny. Blah, blah. Blah, blah. You have acquired all of the upgrades. All of them. Unfortunately, I don't have the money for it. Ah, uh, you're just a couple hundred short. Yeah. yeah, let's talk. I hope you are well, boss. Down here, I only have the minions and the giant robot to keep my company. I swore I saw one of them wink at me the other day. <laughs> Which one? Does it really matter? It's creepy either way. So, this is Lyndon Meyer? I... I don't know. Thanks for the job, boss. Just imagine, if you hadn't hired me, I wouldn't have been stuck inheriting my family's slime farm. What a relief, right? Okay. Who said I'd get my own pony? I like ponies. Wow, I made up that voice before he started speaking. Perfect. <laughs> sort of like how I was starting to do a farm voice for the lime guy. Yep. Rillo Blast. Any huge explosions scheduled for today, boss? All right. Well, that's about all there is. Let's keep going. Look at how we just like run with. We do the Naruto run. Oh, <laughs> hi. Okay, hold on. Oh, there's a disc. Yeah, we probably backtrack the other direction. Maybe? You have to get to level two. Oh, hey, there's an elevator. Alternatively, how do I go down? Elevator off to your right. Hey. Down. Can you go down? Nope. Well, it just said, stand on it, stand on it, stand on it. Left. Oh. How do we, how do we get this thing to function? I mean, you'll have to use this shaft either way, right? No. I. Is there a button? Huh. This you is get the to punch, punch one of, the, of them or the other. Okay. Yeah, I'll try that next. Hey! Wait there! <laughs> okay. Oh, so you can only go up and down, but down you can't you... go it down any oh, further. Oh, I know. I, I see how we do this. Oh! Yeah. yeah. So this is where that idiot dropped my vinyl. 
Turn-based tussle, a true nod to the classics that came before me. There we go. Now you okay. Have it. Oh. And who is that, Albert Frost? Hey, boss. If you ever considered writing a book about all of your adventures, good stuff. All right. <laughs> Bit battle. Okay, so I have to purchase these. Let's go. Let's go bit battle. I don't. How do I get out of this menu? Oh Exit my god, menu. these controls are terrible. <laughs> okay, what are these guys? E. Oh, that guy looks like a lion. Oh, neat meatloaf today in the cafeteria again. Not that I'm complaining or anything, sir. Hexen. Hey, boss. I don't think I could make another one of these princess and another castle jokes. These guys keep oh take another one of these princess and another castle jokes. These guys keep spouting. Permission to bust a cap. And screaming weasel. Oh, you want me to do that? Sure. Um, what does a screaming weasel sound like? I don't know. Like? I just take random NPCs as a practice uh, practice sessions for dumb voices. <laughs> If I keep telling myself another day in paradise, eventually I'll start to believe it. Whatever. <laughs> okay. You'll be glad to know. I have issued a new memo to the minions. They are no longer allowed to have meetings next to explosive red barrels. Why didn't I think of that? Uh, hindsight is twenty twenty. Oh, okay. so they're talking about how villains always stand around the barrels yeah. that you shoot? I can't believe he broke up with me. I can't believe he didn't even try to thwart me. I, I can just imagine the tabloid headlines. Princess faces despair on death ray. Mac Apple has turned sour. That's actually better. Missed my true calling. I almost like the idea of us just collecting stymed princesses. Okay, serious <laughs> question. What if I toss myself off the edge here? What happens? Uh, no. Science! Oh, no, dang it. <laughs> Invisible wall. All right. Oh, so talk. Oh, she's still there. But I did. Did I make money from that? I, I made know. money from something. Did I make money from the jukebox? I. I, I made money from the jukebox. I think so. Huh. But you didn't play the sovereign theme. Well, no, the sovereign's theme was what was running. Oh. Okay. How do I? So how do I? How do I exit? Oh I no. Exit the menu. I'm trying. You're highlighting it. Uh. Okay. There we go. It can. Keyboard controls, not 100% on this game, but it's much easier to aim. Oh hey, this is probably where you get to choose uh, your Aha. assassination. All right. Well, it's the bee bee princess. Oh, I have to get over here. In Insectia. Insectia. Insectian kingdom. Gotcha. How do, how, how do? There we go. I just press buttons until it works. It's usually how it works out. I don't know. We're stepping out of our comfort zones here, boss. But I have received intel report about the princess Apoidia. She rules Insectia with an iron thorax. Or iron mandible. Uh, whatever it is that insects rule with. What's a thorax? Isn't that the butt? Uh, sure. Get in, kidnap the princess, and then get out. I, I assume, do we take space car for this? No? Oh, punch. Uh, try and pick up a jar of honey while you're out. Wham! Oh, <laughs> come on. Co shot? Ah, coins! You're missing all the coins! My coins! Well, whatever. Oh wow, they're fencers. Trying Not for long. Now they're dead. Trying to poke you with their foils. Yep. It's interesting how traditional this uh, this platformer is. Like I was, I really was expecting something a little bit more modern, considering they're tr trying to flip everything on its head. Oh, or at least. I always love music that incorporates a little bit of the bees, if it is a bee level, because uh, 
That's what they had in Banjo Tooie, I believe. There we are. I don't even know what that is. Coinage, I guess. Looks okay. like they do have a lot and of crowns. money. Oh, right. I forgot. I've got a grenade that I can fire. Wow, yeah. They are getting more... They're getting more bee-related as we go along here. More bee-stress. That was terrible. Boisterous. Ha, <laughs> yeah. Uh, what the... Devil... Ah. I don't know if those hurt me. I kind of don't want to figure that out. Why does it even have some kind of weird shield? Huh. So those guys are ranged. Not for long. Now they're just dead. All right, is there... Is there anything? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay. But yeah, I don't know. I, was, I guess I was expecting a, kind of a reverse platformer, more so. Uh, What's some, a reverse platformer? Well, I mean, so the entire point of this game is you're supposed to be the... Uh, the villain. You know, you're supposed to be Eggman. You're supposed to be... Uh... So you were thinking that you were supposed to defend someone? No, like, I, I was I was assuming that we'd be doing, like, the villain stuff while the hero runs through the level. Like, we'd be, we'd be like, you'd be setting one... up minions. We'd be, um... We'd be setting up minions. We'd be running the, you know, death machine, stuff like that. That would be boss monster. Yeah, but, like, that's kind of what I was hoping for here. Because, I don't know, it's, I feel, I feel like there was, there was some potential for, like, a really weird, uh, like I said, reverse platformer of a sort. Ah! I can explosion jump. <laughs> that was a very effeminate scream. <laughs> I know. There we go. There's some health. Back up to full. Let's keep going. I but noticed it, that you've been giving him your pseudo Joker Sidious. I mean, voice. he had the Joker voice. Really? Yeah, kinda. I didn't hear it at the very beginning. It was. Maybe he'll get to say something again. Got him. A Q grenades for making my life easier. Okay, maybe if I try. Ah, come on. Oh, you're using your controller? Well, okay, so. Oh, weird. I'm trying to trying to figure out ah. That's the button. It's a lot easier to precision platform. Oh, we can ledge grab. Interesting. Uh it's a lot easier to precision platform with a uh with a controller. Now I'm supposed to go this direction, which means we want to go back for a bit. Am I? No. I have no idea. I'm puzzled. <laughs> but yeah, uh it's it's hard doing precision platforming. With a nip, yeah. Oh, I guess I did get it. Whatever. We'll wait for a second. Uh, oh, hey, a vinyl. Yep. Uh, You've added thorax waltz to your jukebox. Uh, neat. The jury is still out on what exactly a thorax is. If we take fall damage in this game, not something I want to check well, out. I thought that you were gonna fall into maybe hot honey. Yeah. Okay. The nice thing is, since it is such a traditional platformer... Boss, okay. it appears that they have you sealed in. Stand by, sending a squad of minions to override their control center. Okay. But yeah, I don't know. I, I guess I just feel like they missed kind of a, a golden opportunity. An amber opportunity? I don't know. Uh dumb pun here for something a little bit more unique in a way. Grenadier! <laughs> uh, but I mean, it's not a big deal. It's I, nice to play stylish, like, old school platformers sometimes. I just hope that you actually fight heroes oh, and we bosses will. because... Don't, don't worry. Mac just sort of... Left. <laughs> well, I, I think that's kind of what sets this whole thing off, but I've seen, I've seen screenshots. There's actually a JRPG fight up ahead? Whoa, a JRPG fight? Uh-huh. Go, minions! Oh. Different. Well. Okay. They're just gonna keep rolling. Bouncing. They're... They're gonna try. 
Doesn't work so hot when I'm the man with tons of grenades. Ah, Whoa, a ah, mantis! Ah. What's that doing in the beehive? I mean, I suppose this is an insect kingdom, not just bees, but... So he has a shield. Apparently so. I hate shields. They're annoying. I wonder if... Nope. I can't really charge them up. Oh. But maybe I can... Be patient. Be patient. Okay. I'm just trying to get the arc right here. Oh, I got one of them. There we are. Yeah, so I can just arc my grenades. I've had practice with this today. I've yeah. been doing nothing but platformers today, which is really bizarre. Oh, there's the bizarre. princess. Uh, what is the meaning of this? You're not my usual kidnapper. Where is Scorpio? Uh, he, uh, called in sick. Bad cold. I highly doubt that. Scorpio is a robot. Really? Because I was totally picturing a giant scorpion. Uh, yeah, he gets that a lot. I suppose you just snatch her. What a... Uh, oh, hey, I get float jump now. Well, I've got her. Probably That's... because she's flapping her wings That's while cute. trying to escape you. Well, I'm not gonna get all the coins, but that's okay. I don't care that much. Well, if I, I mean, you get most of them on the tram. Okay, there we go. Kill them all. I'm not entirely sure what those like canisters they drop are. There we go. Perfect. I I like the visual design for this. It's it's kind of a busy game, but like the backgrounds look nice. The style they used for the characters is Whoa. kind of appreciated. Nah, that's good. We just gotta figure out the correct angle to get it over the scorp uh the mantis's head. Well over a shield, that is. Oh that works. Okay. There we go. Nice. Just a little bit of cheese. Yeah, I have no idea what those canisters are. They might be... Oh, what the... They're tightrope walking bees. <laughs> and stupid. <laughs> I like how I just, like, casually look at this. It's like... Oh, oh, those must be, like, unused bombs that haven't opened up. No, no, but they drop from enemies. That's the weird part. Yeah. Like, I actually have... But does it replenish it before your their time, or...? Yeah, I don't know. Say, princess, what's a thorax? Uh, excuse me? How a bug! Is the thorax the butt? Uh, can we keep this kidnapping on a professional level, please? Yeesh, sorry I asked. Okay. Okay, that's good. Yep, looks like you're good. Can I use grenades on this? Nope, doesn't look like it. All right. Whoa. What the? This is new. Oh god. They are. They almost look like messenger mosquitoes or mailmen or. They're defended. <laughs> Pilot bugs or I I don't know. As a prabble. There we go. Wait for them to come to me and then we'll be good past this. And yeah, this is actually really classy. If the, if this had come back uh come out back in the SNES era, uh it actually would have been incredibly well received. Unfortunately, oh. You fell off the hat. Yeah, apparently the hat does not have collision. Keeping that in mind. I don't right. think there's any way you're going to retrieve that loot. No. Well. Oh, God. Scary grenade jumps. Fuck. Oh, no. Wow, that is expensive, too. Yeah, does it take away a thousand points or something? 500. 500. Yeah. I mean, luckily I can just re recover it from grinding levels. But still. Well, it seems like you can stand on the hat to an extent. 
Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. It's just hard to trust. There we go. Let's see if I can get one up. There we go. Okay, we're, in a, we're in a here. New area. Okay. Yeah, luckily we probably don't need that much money. I mean, it's to get your upgrades. Yeah, I'm just not entirely sure how many upgrades uh, there are. Because the first one for 2000 is you get all of the upgrades. All of them. What? Yeah. Didn't you didn't you see that when I was on the uh, yeah. upgrade screen? And I just would think that you would upgrade everything slowly. I it was only two thousand, so I guess we'll see at the end of this level. Now, how many princesses were there? Oh, whoa. five. Five total, and you have you're gonna have two of them at the end of this. <laughs> what you're doing, the evil laugh? What? Hey, <laughs> it's appropriate. Ooh, interesting. I don't know if these platforms start to fall. Fall, yeah, that's what I was starting to wonder. Because they had previously. Yeah, it might have been on that one area, though. I don't know. Either way, grenades win the day. As always. Now you've been getting a lot of uh, achievements based on your grenade usage. I love my grenades. They're the, one they're the most wonderful thing of all. I actually really like games when you've got a pretty slick grenade launcher. I kind of wish I could almost, like, uh, click to... I mean... That doesn't really seem... Uh, that's his only ranged move, though, right? Currently, yeah. I right. don't know if we get more. So, I mean, obviously you would be using laser or beam weapons if you weren't incapable of doing other range skills. Beam? Boss! We tried holding down the palace in your wake, but Dash is hot on our heels. Becky, send out my death pod. It's on the way, sir. Extraction point locked in. Ascend the summit of this tower to rendezvous. Oops. Okay, we got a crown in here. I don't know why our butt's making a tinkling noise. It, it's the coins that you've been running into. Oh, didn't... Oh, well, hi. There we go. No, I need those coins. Need it. Make up for the fact that I can't pay for that soundtrack immediately. Or not soundtrack, uh, I have to pay- There's a large hitbox on that wind. There we go. Okay, there we go. I guess I probably should just fall from the top middle. <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. No! Got it. No! Didn't get it! Ah. <laughs> Stupid fan! Ah. Like I said, huge hitbox on that. If I could. <laughs> yeah, huge hitbox on that. Is it really worth it for one coin? Penny pinching is in my blood. Have you met my mother? <laughs> no, I know your family, of course. Okay, here we go. This is clever, but also meaningless. Maybe I don't know. Me money. This looks like Ooh, Boss Arena. I like how you can see our, our thing in the background. Oh yeah, this you is 100% Boss ship. Arena. Oh, hey! Woo. Oh no, that, that's what you're supposed to climb into. This is totally an Eggman vehicle. Not so fast! Dash, you've come to rescue me! Evil is afoot in the kingdom of Insectia, and that's no good. Prepare to be knocked off your soap, soapbox, Needle Nose. Oh, wow. Okay, so he's summoning... Oh, whoa! So you're just gonna battle him with the, your ball and chain? Yeah! I get to be Eggman today. <laughs> this is good stuff. Uh-oh. Ow. That oh, hurts. shoot. That does hurt. We need to knock down his towers. Ow. Yeah, we do. Ow. Running Crap. in won't help. This is hard. Yeah. Being a boss isn't the easiest job in the world. Well, 
villain, villainous boss. Yeah, come on, one more hit. There we go, got him. Your dumb honey towers won't help you now. How do we, oh, I guess we leave now. Awesome. Level complete. Got everything, respawns too. Eh, time, eh. Grade, eh. Eh, it's still A. Yeah. Welcome back, boss. I see the plan is going smoothly. What a dreadful dreadfort! Is... wait, what? Is this where I'm gonna be lodged? Uh, You're in good company. The Apple can show you around the facilities. <clears throat> I've been doing some research on what you said before, boss. Everyone knows there is some magical force surrounding princesses. That's right! Everyone! Uh, something ancient. Powerful. You're planning on harnessing that power to rule the world. To power a doomsday device. The Doom Howitzer. That is ruthless. I have to say, boss, I'm a little impressed. What a delightfully evil plan. We must now continue our campaign, then, to the east. The Dwarven Kingdom of Winterdown. The Ogre Kingdom of Sukochi. They have been in conflict for years. We'll have to take advantage of this chaos. Doesn't matter which one we do first. Either way, we have to get them both. Oh, so they give you some kind of branching choice? Guess so. That's fun. Okay, so do you want to go to Dwarven Iceland or... Well, we might as well go fiery. Dwarven I Iceland. There's no reason to do them in reverse. You love dwarves. Okay. Okay. Upgrade. I have to use a controller for this for reasons. Okay, blah blah. You have acquired all of the upgrades. All of them. Wait, what? Select it? Something tells me... Um, oh. Go to one that's locked. I can't. Why? I've upgraded... I've got all of the upgrades, apparently. Wait, but there's there's locks. There's Oh wait, nope, nope, now it's working. Okay. What the that was weird. Okay, so we got a missile. Grenade jumping with these is a little bit more difficult. Sticky grenades, assault fire. Okay, so you essentially upgrade your punch, you can upgrade your health, you can upgrade your capacity. Rocket punch, multi punch, triple the punch, more fun. Now do you have to get them in order or can you get any of them? Because they, they seem to have different... Well, it looks like you have your... Yeah, so punch. it looks like I get to... um. It, it looks like I kind of get to pick and choose. Hey, go down to health. I want to see how much it costs to upgrade health. Kind of expensive. Oh, uh, okay. And then ammo upgrades. Whoa! He is a cyborg. Look! Uh, he's lacking one of his arms. Well, he's lacking an arm. So yeah, he's he's just got a robot hand. Right, right. Okay, uh, I'm gonna get Charging Punch, I think. Okay, and quit. Let's try this. Triple Punch, ooh! <laughs> Funny. So yeah, I can charge it up for even more, which is five. So I go three. Now, does talking with your minions do anything more? I want you to talk with Bee Princess and maybe Yeah, people. yeah, we'll, we'll go up and uh, see if we can go talk to them. So it, there is an upgrade system. Oh, there she is. I hate to admit it, but I've seen worse Dreadforts. I've scheduled a dinner date with the human princess. She speaks quite highly of your chefs. Nope, there we go. Alright, uh, let's go back check the soundtracks. Oh yeah, so by picking it up we get, we get money. Yeah. How do we, how do we leave? There we go. Okay. Yeah, I actually really like this game. It's, it's classy. Did you remember to pick up some honey? Who works for who here? I was just checking. Insectian honey is the best in the world. I think you could send down a minion for that. I like what you've done with the place. What do you mean? It seems less, you know, uh, villainy. 
It does? That's terrible. <laughs> I'll speak to my minions. Someone's getting dropped into the ocean. Uh, could still use a good dusting, though. Ah, you're too kind. What, so he likes the fact that there's dust? I guess? I don't know. <laughs> I, I like the characters. I almost kind of wish this was an RPG, in a way. Uh, just, just so okay, we so get more character there's interaction. There's Winter Down, the Dwarven Kingdom. And then there's Sukochi, the Ogre Kingdom. Yeah, we might as well do the Dwarven one, but we'll be doing that on the next episode because this is actually a good stopping point. So I like this game. It's very traditional, almost to the point of being maybe a bit lame? Hey, don't you say that. Well, no, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm mostly talking about like the platforming and the level design and stuff. It's very like, it's so old school, it brings nothing new to the table, well, I'm also, except for the writing. So, it looks like you can get records yeah so e crowns. you get the sound you get the you get the song for the area you're in now does and the crowns are just nice 100 percent or super special on all of these give you some kind of benefit i have or? no idea we'd have to see more but yeah uh, mainly i'm just being a little bit critical on the game because it doesn't bring anything new to the table it hits all the check marks for a good traditional platformer but mm. apart from the writing the game gameplay itself is pretty much anything that i would have seen from a game out of the 90s uh, you know, on the NES, SNES, or, you know, kind of late stuff. But it's good. I mean, I like the visual style. The music's decent. Uh, or at least the music. But again, the writing really is where this game shines. And I wish there was a little bit more of it. But whatever. Anyway, I like it. And I don't know how much it costs. Probably 10 15 bucks. 15 uh, If you like traditional platformers, probably worth picking up. And if you don't, well, it's probably worth a pass. I'm currently controlling the ship with my elbow and it's not working so great. <laughs> There we go. I can fly! Let's see if I can fly around, actually. Let's see if to there's, see like... if there are any other islands. Yeah, let's see. Oh, it doesn't look like... it. I don't actually have the amount of control that I think I had. No. Oh, no, I do, but still not. It'd be nice if I could look around and see how many levels there are. Either way, though. Uh, like I said, this is a great stopping point. So we'll see you guys on the next episode of Nefarious. And as always, thanks for watching. Oh, and of course, seeing as this is the first episode, if you like this in any way, shape, or form, leave us a like. Helps more than you know. And if you want to see more, hit subscribe, because yeah, I'm probably going to shoot for a full playthrough on this. It seems nice and casual, and I kind of really want to see what other weird reverse uh, reverse traditional boss fights we have along the way. I, I wish that there was a more dramatic fun. death scene with the bee hero yeah. or something. Yeah, he just kind of, the, the bee hero just kind of was like, all right. And dead on the ground. It's like, like you would have thought kill that, him? With, that the bee princess would have had like a long history of him saving her from Scorpior or whatever his name was yeah. several times over. And that I kind of hope we do actually run into Scorpior and some of the other villains as we go along too. We'll figure that out. Well, I mean, aren't the villains going to be coming after you because they realize that you're collecting their princesses? Like, I have because Becky no was saying idea. something about how it was going to break some kind of code or creed or I don't know. Well. I'm excited to find out. So, like I was saying, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.